Hello and welcome to another episode of Wicked Easy Cooking. My name is Chef Colin Roach and today we're going to continue with our series on basic vegetable cuts using your kitchen knives so you can make your food look just like the pros. Let's get started. Okay, now I'm going to show you a couple of other cuts. One is a chiffonade. That is usually done with leafy vegetables, basil, I got some spinach here, you could do it with leafy greens, something along those lines. And that's when you're looking to get, you know, a really fine cut. Chiffonade means threads, almost like the thread on your clothes. So it's supposed to be a really fine cut. It's not a slice, so it's not like this. You know, that you're trying to get like these ribbons out of it in all different sizes. You want really precision here. So one way to do that is to stack your leaves, you know, whatever it is, basil, spinach, and then roll them up really tight. There you can see that. And then from there, again, using our claw, I'm going to do really fine. So you can see they're like threads coming off there. Again, really tiny. Got my claw going on. So I can show you these on a plate. So you can see how that, almost like threads that are coming off. That would be called chiffonade, okay? Okay, another kind of a cut you can do is you can get some different tools. This one's called a zester. You know, oftentimes like we were zesting, and this one has a kind of a decorative knife with, this is a channel knife, cuts a channel like in cucumbers and stuff. You can get just a channel knife or a combination with something else. So the, this, uh, the channel would, you know, maybe you do it in a cucumber, or, or a summer squash, I'm gonna do it in a, in a potato, you could do it. And you just put that little channel on the side there and then you just come down. And you see it cuts a channel. So you could do a bunch of those. You know, maybe you're gonna make a, you know, uh, roasted potatoes like that, you wanna cut these. It goes great with cucumbers if you wanna put it into a salad. You know, just, just decorative work that you could use. But you could pick one of these up and be nice. So you can see here, it has all the channels in it. You could roast this like that, put some oil on it, and those channels will be more pronounced. You could also then use your knife and cut discs from it. You know, if you wanted to fry them or cook them this way, and again, different things you could do with it. There's also this zester here. So I'll show you this on a potato. And again, it does the same thing, cuts those little channels, but a lot smaller. So you pull down scores it. Now you can do it on a lemon. Make sure you get a little bit that way. Just cuts those little teeny lines and it zests the outside of it. But you can also use it for decorative work. So you can get some specialty tools if you really want to, you know, fancy up those knife cuts. Okay, so that's it for knife cuts. Now you know how to make those fancy cuts, precision cuts that you could use in your kitchen too to be just like you know the restaurants do. Again, keeping those knives sharp and utilizing them with your skills. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Pass it on to your friends who you think may be interested in that. I appreciate all of you and all of your support. Thanks a lot now. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.